Hi, I'm Dr. Sukhan Shah from Wilmington, Delaware, and I'm here to talk to you about early onset scoliosis and treatment with innovative growing rod technology. The magic rod is an innovative uh, treatment for early onset scoliosis, innovative in the way that it can be lengthened inside the patient non-invasively. You recently heard about traditional growing rods and how they need repeat surgeries to make the rods longer and distract inside the spine and make the spine grow. This rod requires one surgery for implantation, but no other surgeries for lengthening. We'll be able to demonstrate that on this model. This is a model of the spine that has two rods installed in different configurations so that a surgeon may be able to treat different parts of different curves or customize treatment during the lengthening process. This is a rod um, outside the model and I wanted to point out that the magnet or actuator lives on this side of the rod and the rod can elongate through this portion and we're going to illustrate that on the model. This is the external remote control. So imagine um, a child laying down on their stomach and we would take the external remote control, program in how much we want to lengthen the spine and then apply this, the device to the patient's skin. Uh, sometimes it's cold, sometimes it makes a little bit of noise, but we can distract children with child life or the use of an iPad while they're playing. We then turn on the device and it communicates with the internal magnet to extend the length or distract the spine or grow the spine. Once we complete one side lengthening, we may want to do the other rod as well. The procedure is available in the United States. It was approved by the FDA more than three years ago, but the worldwide experience is almost 10 years of clinical safety and efficacy data. One of the other advantages of this technology is that the child can receive lengthenings as frequently, as often as the treatment dictates or the surgeon directs. Because it's non-invasive, a child can have a lengthening every month, um, once a quarter, a few times a year, um, and we do this in the office, in the clinic, rather than in the operating room under anesthesia. It typically does not hurt. Uh, the child uh, can be playing on an iPhone or an iPad with child life or just interacting with their parents while we do the procedure. And um, frequently children don't even know that it's, it's over. We're going to demonstrate on Kobu the Cheetah how we can do this lengthening process non-invasively in the office. Uh, we have the children lay on their stomach, playing on an iPad, just trying to distract them. The procedure doesn't hurt. They can go back to school or parents can go back to the office the same day. And we use a wand to localize the magnet on the patient's back. Once we know where the magnets are, we can customize and program how much length we want to distract the spine or grow the spine. And we put the device onto the back of the patient. and lengthen the rods. Household magnets, anything you find around your community, even airport security is not a problem with the magic rods. Initially there was some concern about MRI. We were able to show that the 1.5 Tesla magnet is perfectly safe. It now has received conditional clearance for the 1.5 Tesla magnet. 